Hello YouTubers, today I received this broken Xbox. So I, I sent the... Uh, I'm just gonna tell you a little story. I sent this Xbox to one of my customers. It was working fine. I tested it out a day before I put it in the, in the post office. But when the Xbox arrived, the buyer told me that it was that it was not working at all and it was displaying some uh, error numbers every time he tried to turn it off so today we're gonna find out what what happened to this xbox and we're gonna try to fix it we're just gonna be opening the box right now okay we just finished uh, opening the box it was a little hard because it had a lot of tape on it so here's the Xbox and we're gonna see what's wrong with it. We're gonna find out right now. There's one more thing that the, the our um, buyer sent us and this is a PS1 mini. He wants us to put a uh, our build up 256 GB. This build has 310 PlayStation 1 games installed and it also has uh, up to 5000 retro games from consoles like Nintendo, Sega Genesis, um, Nintendo 64 and many many other retro consoles but let's uh, check uh, the Xbox to see what's wrong with it as you can see he packed everything really really well so Nothing get damaged on the way here. Uh, we're gonna be back in a little bit. We're gonna try to take all this plastic wrapping. So we finally finished. It was a little bit hard to remove all this plastic bubble from our Xbox. It seems that everything was put in together with tape. But um we're gonna see what we can do to fix this. Okay, we're, no, we're gonna open the Xbox right now. Oh, well, actually, we're gonna test the Xbox to see what, what is the error displaying on the screen. And then we're gonna figure it out what's wrong with it. Okay, we're gonna try to fix it. Okay, we have connected our Xbox to our TV. We're going about to find out what's happening to this Xbox in a second. Okay, let's turn in on the Xbox. And here we go. Okay, it seems that we're having error 16. Let's find out what error 16 means. Okay, so this is what, what the error 16 means. We're gonna see it right now. So it says, it says, error 16 has to do with not finding the menu setting with which you can set the clock of the HD or the hard drive. This happens to a lot of people that erase their HDD or MS dashboard files and after that they don't in immediately install the hard drive but leave the Xbox without power longer than 5 hours okay we're gonna open the Xbox right now and we're going to see we're going to check first we're gonna make sure the hard drive is working we're gonna put the hard drive of this xbox in one of my other xbox over there and we're gonna test it out right now okay we're gonna we're about to open the xbox but it seems that they put a lot of tape on it we don't know the reason why but we're gonna just remove this tape before Taking all, oh, I see why. Okay, so these are loose. 
we're gonna put these uh, little pads on the side I'm gonna remove all the tape We're gonna be right back after we remove all this tape. Oh my goodness, it seems that we're having a bad time trying to remove this tape. It's sticking to other stuff and it's, as you can see here, the letters came off because of the tape. I'm gonna try to remove it carefully, the rest of the tape so we don't damage anything else we're almost done removing this tape so we can have access to the xbox mm -hmm. okay we're done removing the tape we're gonna have to remove this uh, LED light also. Whoa. We don't want to damage it, but uh, this thing has a lot of a lot of uh, this thing has a lot of uh, tape. We're gonna clean this area after we finish with the. after we finish repairing this xbox so we're gonna remove all these screws one two three four five six screws okay we finish uh, removing the screws over here we remove six screws so we're gonna we're gonna remove the cover we're gonna remove the cover to see how it looks inside and here it is um, perhaps the 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 disk drive looks a little bit up because it has scratches on the on this sticker but uh, it, believe it or not this hard drive is it's brand new we asked the seller why why the 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 hardware was scratched and he said that he, that's he has to do that so so the buyers won't return it so if the buyers return it for uh, as defective, he's he's make sure that it's the same drive he sold to the to the buyer. So what we're gonna do right now? We're gonna remove this drive, and we're gonna test it in my other Xbox. If this drive works fine, that means there is something wrong with the with the Xbox. So we're gonna remove it right now. Okay, I just find out that this hard drive is missing two screws. I only found two screws that secure the drive in place. I don't know what's wrong with this hard drive, but we're gonna find out in a little bit. Okay, so we we just uh, installed a hard drive on my one of my Xbox, and we're gonna we're about to test it out to see if the hard drive it's working fine. We just turn on the TV, and we're gonna turn on the Xbox right now to see if it works. Oh my bad, we forgot to connect all the cables. We're gonna be back in a little bit. Okay, we have connected all the cables and we're gonna, we're gonna be testing the hard drive now. Let's turn this baby on. And let's see if it works. And it's working as you can see. So that means the hard drive is working perfectly fine. So now we have to check the Xbox to see what's wrong with it. I have to mention that this Xbox, the Xbox uh, sent to me from the buyer, it's one of the first uh, 
it's one of the first Xbox editions and they were um, known to have a lot of issues so yeah as you can see it's the same hard drive I'm now testing it with this Xbox and it's working perfectly fine so we're now going to check the other Xbox to see what's wrong with it mm -hmm. So the first thing we're gonna check in this Xbox is the DVD drive. It seems that uh, sometimes the, if the DVD drive is faulty, it's not, it's, if it's not working, then the Xbox won't boot up. So we're gonna check that first and make sure it's not the DVD, the one that is preventing the Xbox to boot up to the to the main menu. Okay, so we have installed the, the hard drive back to the Xbox sent to us by our friend Teddy and we're gonna test it out right now and we also put an, another DVD drive, it's a Samsung one just to make sure it's not the DVD drive, the one that is making the Xbox uh, malfunction or not working we're, gonna about, we're about to test it out right now we're gonna turn on the TV and see if it works this time. So it seems that it's working now. Yeah, we found the mist. We found the 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 error. It's the DVD drive, the one that is preventing the Xbox to boot up. So we're gonna have to ask the buyer to purchase a new DVD drive. As you can see, it's working perfectly fine now. Now that I have put the the DVD drive, so we finally found the mistake. And this is it, my friends. Thank you for watching this video, and we're gonna see you next time.